Gol kontroversial Bahrain di menit akhir sama sekali tidak dicek VAR oleh wasit. Gol kontroversial dari timnas Bahrain di menit akhir pertandingan ini sangat menjadi tanda tanya besar karena tak dicek VAR sama sekali. Sekilas terlihat pemain bernomor punggung 9 melakukan pergerakan terlebih dahulu sebelum ditendang pemain nomor 8 sob. Menurut saya gol ini seharusnya direview VAR terlebih dahulu, tidak langsung disahkan oleh Pak Wasit yang sangat terhormat. No. We are gonna lose against Indonesia. Uh, referee, we need three minutes extra. Not possible, not possible. Not possible? Uh, we need to, we need to draw this. Yalla, tafaddal with the cash. Tafaddal, tafaddal, more, more, more. Give me three minutes. Tafaddal, more, more. Three minutes extra. Three minutes, you give me everything of the money. Everything? Everything of the money, brother. Yalla. Okay, uh, let us score, please. Yalla, 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 habibi. Thank you. So, I see this as borderline criminal from the referee. I see this as... It's hard to say there isn't some kind of foul play here. I'm not one to build conspiracies or anything like that, but it just seems like the ref got it wrong. He added yeah. way too much time at the end there, and it cost Indonesia. But the big question is, should Indonesia have held on? 100%, I think all of our Indonesian fans would have been super happy. But the way it happened, guys, were they robbed? Were they robbed? Let's talk about that. Yes. I think the answer is yes, or I mean, I think maybe the referee was dyslexic, maybe he saw the six, thought it was a nine, and that's why he put on nine minutes. I honestly don't get it. I, I, I feel that six minutes means six minutes, right? And, and maybe a little bit extra. But for me, it went on too long, and it felt very much like a home field advantage for right? Bahrain. Yeah, it was, that really, really hurt to watch because Six minutes never means six minutes. First of all, let's be real. There was a yellow card in there. So then you push it to seven, right? You push it to six and a half. You push it to 6.45. You push it to almost nine minutes. Indonesia deserved to take three points from this game. They deserve the biggest victory in the history of the Garudas. It wasn't to be, right? Because what's six or nine? Six? That was painful. That was painful. That hurt my heart. And let me start by saying something that I'm going to say very, very poorly, but I hope all of my Indonesian friends feeling this tie will hear me and will feel that I mean it. Kami mencintaimu. You guys know what that means? Rocky and Sato, are you fluent? In the language of Indonesia. Teach us, teach us the ways, Roy. Teach us the ways. Hada video khususan na hamil kaf hakam bara hakam. Wallah al azim. Inta Arabi wa na Arabi. Walakin anin rosi. Lesh kena ya khi. Mufrud nahan fuz al bahrain idnen wahad. Al mufrud le kan idnen fi taadul. Al mufrud sed dajaj wal dzayid tisa dajaj. Lesh kena. انت حكم ما هو لاعب حق مرمى حق لاعب حق كرة السلة انت اخرت ال... اخرت الاهداف حقنا اخرت الاحلام حقنا حق الاندونيسيين عشان ندخل كاس العالم وطيب ليه انت والله حرام عليك الله يهديك الله يحفظك والله الله يعطيك العافيه حتى ليش كذا؟ حتى المدرب حقنا سنتا يوم اعطيته كارت احمر كارت احمر من راضي على الكارت الاحمر ده هذا بسبب ايش؟ بسبب انت زيد بتسع دقائق I want to know right away in the comments did Indonesia get robbed let me know what you thought about that ending in the Indonesia versus Bahrain match that ended 2-2 after Bahrain tied it in the very last play the very final minute the 99th minute of the match problem here is the ref only added six minutes and the game should have ended in the 96th minute. We're talking about three free minutes that were given in this game. And folks, being unbiased, being true to what I saw, it's the wrong call. It's the wrong call. I'm sorry. We're talking about three minutes, guys. Three minutes. But the reason that I am so frustrated with this result and what the referee ultimately decided is because this was going to be probably 
the most impressive victory in Indonesia's history. In the second half, I loved what I saw from Indonesia, Marcelino coming on into this match, and then Strauch just finding a way to score a beauty of a goal from the corner of the box to make it 2-1. I thought Indonesia had it, but then you know, craziness happens in the end. Ref adds six minutes, it goes all the way to the 99th, and Bahrain scores and ties this match. I'm frustrated because these are three massive points that Indonesia does not get, and they have to settle for one in a very controversial ending, in my opinion. Referee butok ni betul buat high lah. Tambahan masa 6 minit jadi 9 minit mat. Kan? Timnas Indonesia tadi sepatutnya dah menang. Tapi disebabkan botok ni mat drag masa tambahan tu sampai 3 minit. Mana mai 3 minit tu mat? Dah tambah masa 6 minit, dia tambah lagi 3 jadi 9 minit. No, Bahrain score last minit draw game tu. Sepatutnya Timnas Indonesia dah menang dah 2-1 kan. Game dah jentik, game dah shock. Referee pula buat spoil mat. Dia lupa nak tiup whistle. Whistle dia jatuh. Kalau whistle saja jatuh tak apa. Jadi sekali ingat otak-otak dia sekali jatuh tak pada dengan kepala botak <laughs> hai hari ini adalah hari jumaat yang mana katib selalunya akan kata hadirin yang berbahagia tapi aku tak rasa ada orang Indonesia yang berbahagia pada hari ini atas peristiwa wasit curang yang berlaku dekat game malam tadi okey jom aku sembang sikit siapa referee ni dan Berapa banyak meme yang dah keluar pada hari ini. Sebelum tu, korang yang minat konten-konten sepak bola, jangan lupa tekan butang follow dekat sini. Dah tekan? Mantap cuy. So, nama wasit ni adalah Ahmed Al-Kaf yang sudah menjadi referee sejak pada tahun 2010. Dan dia berasal daripada negara Oman. Okay? Negara Oman adalah negara Arab. Sebab itulah timbulnya kontroversi pasal benda ni Bukan dekat game malam tadi sahaja Even dekat sebelum-sebelum ni pun Kalau ingat ada uh, ada yang Indonesia lawan Qatar tu kan Referee Arab juga Jadi memang orang sudah mula mempersoalkan Wasit-wasit daripada Timur Tengah ni Semalam memang banyak betul meme Dan bukan daripada channel Indonesia semata-mata Even channel international pun Recognize kesalahan yang berlaku semalam 90 campur 6 99 And this one pun daripada channel uh, international juga uh, Troll Football tak silap aku AFC equal to Arabian Football Corruption Ada juga yang bagi tahu Selepas game tu habis Channel AFC ASEAN Cup ni memang kena serbu habis Dengan orang-orang Indonesia 137,000 komen Dalam masa 13 minit. Webro pun tak pernah dapat sebanyak tu. <laughs> Tapi dalam banyak-banyak reply yang kelakar, aku rasa yang ni kelakar juga. Next time, cari referee yang macam ni. Belum lagi minit 90, dah tiup wisin. Ha, kan senang. Okay. So, itulah dia pasal wasit curang ni. Adakah aku rasa benda ni akan berhenti? Tidak. Aku rasa benda ni akan berterusan. Tak tahulah sampai bila. Korang komen pendapat korang dekat bawah. Dan macam biasa, yang belum follow lagi akaun ni, tekan butang follow.